When it comes to bourbon, you can find a variety at Smoke Justice that's as big as the bluegrass. So this is the second incarnation of Roebling Rare that we've done. Managing partners Damian Wilson and Jade Caldwell want to serve up something their customers can't get anywhere else. What we're looking for is unique flavors um, that not only can fit our guest experience, uh, but they can only find with us. What we're going to be doing here today is what we like to call our boutique blending experience. The Smoke Justice crew took us along to Wenzel Whiskey in Covington in search of a perfect mix. We're going to do exactly what Henry Wenzel did 150 years ago today in this room. Henry Wenzel was a rectifier. That means non-distilling producer. So everyone today is a rectifier. You will be making your own specific bourbon. Part bourbon tour, part chemistry lesson, our group sampled four barrel-proof whiskeys from Kentucky, Indiana, Georgia, and Louisiana. This all came directly from barrels this morning. These have, this one right here has little pieces of the, the barrel in it still. I kind of like the Georgia. I liked my Kentucky and Indiana, like closer to home. But our lesson didn't end with the tasting. This is the arts and crafts with booze part. It's fun. It's a chemistry test you can't fail. Milliliter by milliliter, each of us measured which whiskey in which amounts were most pleasing to our palates. I have everyone's blend that just blended something that they uniquely created and that's uniquely theirs. And I'm going to mix them all up, blend them for them, and hand them to them kind of blind to where we get to determine whose is the actual best and whose will be the next Roebling Rare. Then, another taste. Oh, that's pretty good. We do have a tie. And it's four votes to four votes. Turns out Jen and Jade have the penchant for the best pour. Each created a blend that's worthy of a spot on the northern Kentucky end of the bourbon trail. Women are the ones who can typically drink something spicy or something hotter and really pull apart the flavor notes of it, which I find really interesting. But it's not just my opinion. It's also scientifically proven. Only one blend will bear the name of Roebling Rare, and once it's gone, it's gone. You know, so that's where the richness of this experience really comes into play is all of us collaborating together and kind of create something never can be created again. Now you can go for your own blending session at Wenzel Whiskey in Covington. They offer tastings inside an old pickle factory oh. and they just bought a building uh, next door where they're going to start their own distilling of their own Kentucky bourbon sometime soon. But that was su such a unique and neat experience, wasn't it? It was so neat to be, you know, I felt like we were almost back in Prohibition. We had to go back into this back alley, into this cool <laughs> building, yeah. and we had these special tools that we were blending things. It was really neat. That's what I, I you look like a mad scientist. I mean, you had pipettes yeah, right? and graduated cylinders. Oh, and yeah. all the things. And I know there's a whole chemistry to it, right. but for us it was just kind of fun. Right. Did uh -huh. you mention the proof of some of those things? No. A hundred hundred and like twelve, a hundred and twenty. You guys proof. weren't drunk afterwards? No, you, you had to you had to take the tiniest little steps. Yes. And sometimes uh -huh. you had to you had to get rid of it. Yeah. <laughs> How can you yeah. tell with just a little sip? What's good? Yeah. It's so <laughs> flavorful that mm -hmm. you can yeah. I oh, think okay. when it's I think when it's that strong, it just literally does only need a small amount to yeah. sort wow. of take over all your senses. Okay. It's, it's really, really neat. Hey there. Yeah, you could stop watching right now, but let's be honest, you don't want to do that. Hit the links or click subscribe to see more amazing content from all of us here at Local 12.